really brings together a lot of what you were talking about, all the things we've been talking about today. You get to see a lot of it here. This uses Windows, it uses Touch, and, uh, and it uses Silverlight as well. It's an application that is used for watching movies, but I really want to take my movie watching experience to the next level. So here I've got Star Trek, and I can go ahead, and notice I'm doing this whole thing on Touch. As Tammy said, we actually have these 3M monitors up here. They're fully capacitive. They easily handle 10 points of input on touch and really nice monitors. As I go ahead, I hit play. I can go ahead, swipe this menu up, kind of skip some chapters, and use, use touch to kind of even navigate through the chapters of the movie. Now, if I also want to go ahead and create a clip, I go ahead here, and this is also connected to my social network. So I'm going to say create clip, and as I do that, I see some clips here. I go ahead, take this one, drag it down to Facebook, and just that simple, it's what shared that clip nice. to Facebook. Nice and easy. Very nice. Great integration. So, I want to show one other thing here. As I go up uh, to another scene that I like here, I'm going to navigate over here, and I really want to take my movie watching experience to the next level. So, I want to know about these characters that are actually in the movie. So, I'm actually going to touch the person's face. Captain Kirk, I go ahead, touch his face, and it knows who it is. If I want more, I just click here for more and bing. I get all sorts of information about Captain Kirk. I can even get images right there in the movie experience. That is cool. Yeah, not that only that, cool. it even knows the actors that are playing the characters. So watch this. I want to know who's playing Scotty. More on actor Simon Pegg. I go ahead and do the same thing and bing again. I get all sorts of information, including images of the actor right from within the app. Very nice. Very cool. Fabulous. You know, Tammy also talked about the way you can develop for other, for other devices as well. And here, I've got a Windows, 7, Windows Phone 7, and I've actually loaded the same application with Power Visual Studio 2010. You're able to build applications in an easy way for, for more than just the PC. You've got my My Clips here. You see the same sort of navigation. I can go ahead, click into one of the clips, and it automatically plays on my phone as well. Really great integration, really great way to see all these apps. And it really reminds us that Windows brings massive reach. You get to program for the entire globe. You get these rich and immersive experiences on these applications. With IE9, we're really going to help bring IE9 to bring the web to the next level with all of your health. And with the cloud, it brings it all together. Reach a billion customers. That's right. Brian, thank you very much. Thank you, Tammy. Right, thank you.